Well, they are calling it the North Queensland Massacre. The Blues absolutely sweeping the floor with the Maroons. It was ruthless. It was beautiful. New South Wales' biggest ever state of origin win against Queensland. And Blues coach Brad Fittler, well, he must be pretty chuffed with himself this morning. And he joins us now. Freddie, redemption is sweet, my friend. What a win, huh? Oh, that was fantastic. I think when you said beautiful, the way they played the boys, the way they come together and... Um... Now, yeah, what well, they delivered on the field, I thought was, like you said, beautiful. I mean, if you think about last year's loss, it, it was pretty tough. And, and you made the point you didn't go with your gut last year. Whatever you went with this time round, go with it again, I say. What did you say to the boys before they ran out last night? Oh, we had a moment during the week, actually, where we had a few of the boys' parents come in. I think it's not until sometimes when you see the effect... Um, it has on families and you know the friends of New South Wales. I and mean, we've had a bit of a dud couple of years, Ali. We've had floods, fires, and I think it was just a matter of we just had to do whatever it took, and they did last night, and they did it with style. So the Blues found their heart last night. They did. They did. They've had it before. They've had it before. Oh, so not like good. what we saw uh, last they, night. They did though. it under pressure, and mm. yeah, it was good. Good to watch. So what do you reckon is going to happen now? Because the Maroons have had a fair few injuries, um, but they look they just didn't know what to do last night. Are you expecting them to came, come back game two? Yeah, absolutely. Well, they'll, get, they'll have a change of, uh, of personnel. I think Josh Papali will come back in. Uh, Callum Ponga uh, should be available, I think. And also everyone goes back and plays a couple of weeks with their club. So uh, this is a bit of a nervous wait for the coaches. and. Mm -hmm. Just hopefully they all go back and perform really well for their clubs and, uh, you know, that's about it. you just got to just sit and wait at the moment, Ali. Mm. I tell you what, though, it was an exciting game to watch last night. It was fast. There were no high tackles, well, very few high tackles. Do you think that's proof that the new rules do work? Well, I think both teams were very responsible in the fact of the way they, the way they tackle and the way they defended. You can see there was... Um, yeah, they were conscious about it, purely because I don't think they wanted to put the referee under pressure. And um, so I think they helped the referee out in that manner. And I think all in all, the game looked better. Uh, yeah, obviously the, the scoreline wasn't great for Queensland, but mm. uh, the football that got on, I think anyone who watched would be watching the next game. Just to, you know, just the skill level was was very high. We weren't sure how it was going to go, you know, running out to in Townsville there and, you know, we knew they were going to be booed, the crowd was against them. Did that just fire up the boys? It wasn't too bad around the streets. When we got around the streets, it was, they were quite pleasant, actually, but when you turned up and there was, you could, you know, there would have been just a flitter of blue jerseys in amongst just a sea of maroon. It was quite... Overwhelming, actually, the, the colour once you got there. It was literally everyone had a maroon jersey on and you know, a couple of little loyal supporters in and around. So um, I'm sure they had, you know, that was one night they'll remember. Yeah, tonight Carl will remember too. Um, have you got a little message for him? I just got to, he's just put his headphones yeah. on. He's pretending he's not listening. No, no, no. Freddie's got a message for you. Freddie, got a message for Carl. He's listening. <laughs> how's he been here? How's it? How's your beanie looking today, Carl? Whoa, said with real <laughs> venom, Freddie. Yeah, yeah. Well, you know what? That first penalty was a disgrace. <laughs> it's all he's got this morning. <laughs> <laughs> that would have meant Three a lot to you. Two weeks, Carl. Good on two you, weeks, Freddie. Mate. Good on you, mate. Actually, it would have meant a lot to you two last weeks. night. So I, I, I'm going to give you that one, Freddie, but that's it. That's all I'm giving you. We'll be back. We'll be back. Good stuff, Freddie. We loved <laughs> thanks, it. Mate. We're very happy this <laughs> morning. Can't wait for game two, my friend. And thanks for getting up early for us. Good-o. Thanks, Al. Yeah. I wish he was an uh, awful person, well, Freddie. It'd be much easier to hate. <laughs> <laughs> you, can't love, you can't hate that face, <laughs> can him. you? Love him. All right, well, Colin.